guys, it's Lori. Uh, tonight I am going to be updating you guys about the first FabFitFun winter box spoiler. Um, the first spoiler was not set to be released until like November 1st, I think. But they posted on the community forums on the um, FabFitFun site and said that they were breaking their own rules and releasing the first spoiler early. So I wanted to be the first to bring you the first winter box spoiler for FabFitFun. Um, and let me tell you, I am really excited about this spoiler because we already knew one item um, a while back. Actually, it came, I think, in the magazine for the fall box. There was a little, like, crossword, not crossword puzzle, but, like, a little code on the bottom to figure out the first spoiler, and it was faux fur blanket. So we knew that there was a faux, faux fur blanket coming to the winter box, but we didn't know anything else about it. But now we have the details. We know the brand and what it looks like of this blanket, and then we also know the other items in this choice category. So if you're not familiar with FabFitFun, they have two levels of membership. One is seasonal, where you can customize like the first three items in your box. Um, and then they have, and with the seasonal, membership you just pay each quarter like it renews every quarter you pay every quarter and you can choose three items there's also the annual membership which you pay it all up front in one bulk thing you save five dollars off each box and you get to customize five items in your box um i personally am an annual subscriber i signed up last year um, as an annual, and this winter box is actually the last one in my subscription as an annual member. Um, so we'll see how winter box goes. I was actually kind of disappointed with the fall box, but um, the value is still there, but it just wasn't that exciting. But winter is starting to look really awesome. So anyways, let me quit rambling and get into the spoilers. Um, so the first item, um, and sorry, let me back up a second. So this first spoiler, it's five items, but it is for one category. So you will be able to choose one item out of these five for that first category. And they did say on their spoiler post that this is a choice item for annual and seasonal members. So everyone can make this choice. So anyways, the first item is the Kate Somerville... If I can talk. The Kate Somerville Goat Milk Moisturizing Cream. Um... It's a $65 value. So that is spoiler number one. Spoiler number two is, this is the fur blanket that we knew about, or the faux fur blanket we knew about. It is Unhide Little Marshmallow Blanket for $65. And they had a spoiler video that they kind of showed the blanket and it looks so soft. I am definitely choosing that. Um, now hopefully, We've always been able to add additional items for $10. The last couple boxes, they have changed the prices of the items. So if winter is going to follow their past couple boxes, my guess is you'll be able to add additional items in this category, but it'll be $15 because that first one or two tiers, um, the last two boxes has been a $15 add-on. Um, but the items in this category are great. So... I might be tempted to add um, another item or two for um, $15. Wow, sorry, I just like clicked away from what I was doing here. Okay, sorry, I've got um, the spoiler post up here on my phone. So I'm just kind of showing or reading off the items. So the next item, the third item you can choose is a Jonathan Adler Fleur de Sel ceramic candle. Um, it's a $48 value and it looks like a really nice ceramic candle. Um, see if I can give you a close up here. So it is, there we go. Oh, whoa, that went a little crazy. Sorry, I was trying to show you, but that is, looks like a really nice little ceramic pot for the candle. $48 value looks fun. I'm not really into candles. If I'm going to get a candle, I'll get a $20 candle at Bath and Body Works when it goes on sale, but that looks fun. And then the next one is Rebecca Minkoff Marled Beanie and Arm Warmer set. That's a $70 value. Um, that looks really cute too. Um, and then the last item is the R & Co Television Perfect Hair Shampoo and Conditioner that is a $64 value. 
So like I said, that seems like that category has something for everyone. Most of those items, if not all, I guess the shampoo and conditioner note, but all the other items scream winter to me because that was kind of the complaint with the fall box. People were like, this does not seem like a fall box. This just seems like a random box thrown together. But I would say hat and glove set or hat and arm warmer set sounds like winter to me. Candle, like a cozy um, ceramic candle definitely seems like winter to me. A faux fur blanket for sure seems like winter to me. And a moisturizing face cream, great for dry skin in the winter. All those things seem like great winter items. So I am definitely excited about this upcoming winter box. Now, I wanted to give you guys a little bit more of an update with FabFitFun because of course they're always changing things, right? So normally, um, add a, or customization opens for seasonal, no, annual members. And then add-ons open. And then a little while later, the seasonal members get to customize. And then their add-ons open. Which, it will still follow that same pattern. But the annual members have a shorter add-on window. And then, like, our customization, our add-ons will completely end. And then the seasonal members will get their customization and then their add-ons. So, it's... It won't be overlapping. Now they have said that um, annual people, people who have the year-long membership, can still shop during the add-on time period for the seasonal members, but it may delay their box and it might ship separately because they're going to try to get our boxes shipped out right away. So they're trying to improve. People's complaints have been that the annual members are supposed to ship first and get priority shipping, but a lot of times people who are seasonal, their stuff gets shipped out before the annuals. So they're trying to fix that. It makes total sense. Um, I just hope it isn't too crazy. So let me give you the, the dates for all of this. So add-ons for the annual members or select, they call it select. Sorry, I've been saying annual, but for the select members, start November 1st. So our add-ons are going to start before we can customize our box. So from November 1st to November 5th is when annual or select members can shop the add-on sale. Now customization, the first time we can customize is November 2nd. So we have from November 2nd to November 5th to customize our winter box. And then after that 5th, it closes. Like your box is customized, your add-ons are done, and billing will happen on November 7th for annual people. And then they have the next dates. It's They're calling it all access date. This is for the seasonal peoples. Peoples? Wow. What am I talking about today? Seasonal people. Um, your add-ons are going to start on November 14th and be November 14th through the 18th. Um, like I said before, Annual members can shop during that window, but it might delay your box and you might have additional shipping charges if they ship it out separately. Um, and then customization for people who pay quarterly, people who are the seasonal members, is November 15th through the 18th. And then on the 18th, that window closes. Both the add-ons and the customization is going to close for the seasonal members. And bill date is November 20th. Now, for some reason, there's a third or a second bill date. I'm not sure why they have a second bill date for that tier of people, and that's November 27th. Um, so that's kind of a heads up. I will definitely be giving you spoilers. Um, as soon as the add-on sale opens on November 1st, I will come on here and give you spoiler videos, trying to update you on what's in the sale, um, what I'm picking up and stuff. So look forward to that. And I'm sure we'll get some more spoilers between now and then. Um, on their Facebook forums, um, FabFitFun site, they had said that all the spoilers would happen after um, that November 1st date or the November 2nd date, which doesn't seem like it makes any sense, which is probably why they broke their rules and started the spoilers early. So hopefully we'll see some more spoilers. If not, I will definitely um, give you the spoilers as soon as I get them, as soon as I can log in there and customize my box. I will show you what I chose and show you the options so that you are the first to know what you can get in your winter box. Um, 
So yeah, if you have any questions about what I said, if anything was unclear, leave me questions or comments down below. Otherwise, give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed um, the spoilers and be sure and subscribe so that I can bring you the most up-to-date um, spoilers and unboxings with all these fun subscription boxes. And yeah, until next time, I'll see you guys later.